What's up guys? Back for another episode of a story of art. And I got a new pterodactyl. and oh boy, Looty McGloot face. He's called Ax, so I've been using him to go around doing some beacon runs and I've got him levelled up to try and get his stamina up because god damn the pterodon stamina is awful at the start. Uh, but I've not really found anything, to be honest. Um, I kept a Dodic saddle blueprint and a ghillie suit blueprint and everything else was pretty trash to be fair. Um, but I've decided I don't really need anything. Um, I was doing some loot running to see if I could grab some blueprints or armor or anything before I take Betty down into a cave. And um, <laughs> then I remembered that I'm already wearing like an Ascendant flat chest piece, some ghillie leggings, ghillie boots, ghillie um, helmet, which is all Ascendant. Um, the only thing I could really do with, which the chance of me finding a pretty slim, is uh, an Ascendant shotgun. So, uh, and I think we can go without that. So, I think I'm just going to jump on Betty and we'll get get her down in a cave and have another crack at the one along the coast here that we lost Barry in. Decided to actually make some modifications to the stable. I said in the episode when I built it, the last episode, I weren't sure about the um, open sides on it. It started growing on me, so I left it, but I weren't sure. And then I had another idea about um, this like viewing platform to look inside because originally I wanted it so that you could walk past and see through. That was why I was putting the railings in. But um, obviously it didn't work how I wanted it to. So I've come up with this solution and I actually like it. I think it looks really smart. Um, let me know what you guys think in the comment. What you guys think? Oh man, English hard. But uh, yeah, <laughs> let me know what you think in the comments. But yeah, this is, this is um, how it's ended up and I like that it's actually four railings high now. I weren't sure whether that was going to look alright or not, but anyway, you can see Betty at the back now. I've been and got my Dodic back, and we've got a new guy. we got Poop Pump, the Fiomia, who, um, when I was taming Looty McLootface, was just running around near me, and um, I thought might as well tame that as well, because we're going to need one at some point to farm up some poop, hence the name, Poopy Pump. Um, or Poop Pump. <laughs> And then on this side I've done the same and extended this deck out this way. And I'm thinking what I might do is off the middle of here, you know, in the middle of the stable, out that way, is put like a fishing pier on. Because uh, I don't know if there's anything down there at the minute. But there's normally some fish swimming around in this bit. Oh, sod's law, I'll go and show you and they're not here. Maybe my uh, pets over there have eaten them. But you can see there's a lot of fish around this area out, out there. Look, But they do actually come into these shallows. Oh, there's one. So yeah, I was going to build like a fishing pier type thing come out the middle of there just for something extra to the um, build. But yeah, that's about it really. That's about it. Caught up. Oh, and I got a new Argent. Got a new Argent Tavis. Oh boy. Andy the Argent Tavis. I've already leveled him up quite a lot as you can see. 226. And he was a 112. Um, I wanted something higher but just, you know, well, you've seen when I was trying to get my T-Rex I just can't seem to find any high levels in... And Betty in the last episode was a nightmare even to find a 120, so, you know, 112s are right, I don't really need an Argent for that much other than like flying about, carrying things, a little bit of meat farming maybe, but, you know, I think that'll be fine. If I need anything, I will definitely go and look, but, you know, Andy will do me, so, uh, got Andy, Andy's been retired, I ain't gonna kill her like I've done to my tapages. Gonna leave her in here because she's just so cute. Look at her. Oh, yeah, Annie. So Annie's staying in there, in a not enjoying retirement. But yeah, I think that's everything caught up. So now I'm just gonna jump on uh, Betty. Oh no, I'm not. I'm gonna get some grappling hooks made um, because I've learnt my mistake from the last time trying to get across to that obsidian, which weren't even worth it. Um, and if I had a grappling hook, it would have been easier. Well, it was obviously we jumped it. It was fine, but you know what I mean. It'd be nice to have a grappling hook, so hopefully I can make some. All right, just need some arrows and some thatch. Oh no, I actually run out of metal. I'm not been paying attention. Oh well, we've got three grappling hooks anyway. Well, I'll just hope that'll be enough. Um, I'm not even sure if I'm going to need them, but I thought I'd better take some just in case. All right, shotgun, pick, hatchet. Bowlers, don't know if I need them. I'll keep them on me. Oh, better top my water bottle up. So, 
fingers crossed this will all go well. I don't want to lose another barrel, and especially uh, Betty, because I've put quite a bit of time into leveling her up, to be honest. Um, and I'm not sure how hard this is going to be, obviously, since I went down there before, we've turned all the um, levels up. So, <laughs> it could be tragic, but I'm, I've got faith in Betty. She's super fucking high level now, so should be able to handle most things in here. And uh, got my shotgun. It's not ascendant, but you know. Oh boy. Ah, uh, what I didn't bring is a torch. Oh, <laughs> uh, oh. Hopefully I won't need it. Hopefully you guys can see. All right, on the gamma, the gamma termed up. Right. Let the fun begin. All right. Uh. Well, but he's definitely tanky. Well, if that's anything to go by, um, we're like over ready. <laughs> On the other, yeah, obviously the reason I'm down here, I didn't mention it, is because um, to see if we can get any decent loot from down here. Because I think you do get higher quality loot out of the um, loot crates and stuff down here. Obviously, this is the uh, lava cave on the um, like southeast side of the island. Can I? Well, we won't waste the ammo. I was wondering if I could attack with Betty and shoot with. Can I? No, because I'm on it. Okay. God damn, they ain't made a dent in her health yet. I was trying to hit 20k. <laughs> oh, mate. Okay. Don't think you need 20k. Let's get around this one. Here. Please don't fall down. Let's coat these back here and kill them in case I fall down that bloody hole. Oh! There's a leak box, sweet. Come on. How do I get over there? After last time, I'm scared to try and jump over. I can make that first jump, but I don't know how I can, if I can like jump back because it's slightly above that. Do you know what I mean? Like, that's, if I jump from this side, I'm jumping down to it. But to jump back, I got to jump up. I don't think I can do it. Let's go around this way. Oh boy, that is taking a bit of a beating now. She has killed a lot of stuff, though. <laughs> Let's leave her here a minute. Put her on passive just so she doesn't come charging over here. And hopefully she'll be safe here. Oh, boy. Get this loaded. Oh, there's an arrow on the wall over there. Right. 
Fucking go! Yep. Yeah, buddy. Okay, okay. Where's the spitter? Okay, loot crate. Oh, ascendant pistol and stone hatchet. Fuck off. Mate. Okay, let's um Oh, it did. Oh, that was a nice surprise. Cheers, bud. Well, <laughs> a bit of luck. That oh, wasn't hard. It was fine. But um, normally that's the kind of stuff where I get trolled. So you know, oh, that weren't weren't really worth the grappling hook to be fair. Though. It's a bit annoying. Oh, I don't think me. Um, Heals them as well as fish or even at all. I didn't bring any fish. I did forget that. I'll right. we'll keep going this way and see what else is in there. But... Um, I had a little look on the wiki, but the map hasn't been updated for this cave since they um, changed the caves. It's, I think it's the only one they haven't updated. Oh, well, they're saying that isn't actually a map for anything. Yeah. Yeah, so um, just got to kind of go with it and hope for the best. But this way seems alright so far. I come in and went round to the left, so. Uh, last time I went to the right where I lost uh, Barry, but there was a, an explorer note around that way, so I probably will go back and see if there's anything else around there. What I should have done is bought some um, standing torches as well to. Help me remember where I've been. I'm starting to think I should have bought more grappling hooks because I feel like I should go along that way. Can I see anything wrong with this? I mean, that effect makes it look like that's either where the artifact is or another loot crate. I can jump down there, I can definitely get across there with or without Betty, without using a grappling hook. Or just jumping with Betty. Um, again, I don't know how many grappling hooks I need if I go down that way and commit to it, and I don't know if I jump down there with Betty if I can actually get her out. You know what? You stay there, Betty. Got this. Fucking go! Yeah. Oh, reload. Oh, boy. Oh, no. We're almost naked now, I think. Okay. Oh, that's the artifact over there, isn't it? Stuck and it's the rock. Oh. Starting to get low on ammo here a bit. There it is. is there anything over there? The lava's so bright I can't see through the um, glow. Whoa! Okay. Okay. Good, good. So bright. I don't think there's anything. I can't see anything. Oh no, can I get up there? Ooh, I thought it was going to bounce off. Does this go around the same way? Oh, there's a chest there. Um. Yes. Oh, that's. Slapped miles away. Come on, then, what's this one? Oh man! Megaloceros dossier. Oh, I was hoping it was going to be something cool. Right. Is there an easier way around that? 
because I've only got two grappling hooks and I might need one to get back. Right, okay. Betty save me. <laughs> I think what I'll do is I'll try and get back to Betty. Um, we'll run round to the other side of the cave. Can I get back? Is that right using it? Ooh, yes I can. Oh, that's making me wonder now if I... Um... I mean, you know what? We don't need the um, artifact right now, but at least I know where it is now. You've got to come in and go around to the left side of the cave. We'll go back round the other way, the, where I went last week, or the other week, whenever it was, that we'd done come down here with Barry and lost him. And um, see if it joins up with that way, um, with that side, because that started getting really confusing running that way, and I don't want to get lost down here and get Betty stuck. Um, and like I said, if I jump down there, I don't know if I can get her back out, but if that obviously goes all the way around, it would have been alright, but I don't know that for certain. And um, I don't want to risk it, so I'm going to run back to the start of the cave and go the other way. Don't fall down. And, um, oh crap, what's the time? Okay, I should still be asleep. Yeah, yeah we'll get back around the other way. Um, it should be this way. Barry is down there somewhere, I think. If he's still alive. I still never got a death message, so I don't know what happened to him. <laughs> oh no, do I risk it? I don't know if I'll be able to jump back out if I jump down there. It looks like it's level, doesn't it? Okay. Hopefully, um, what I mean by that, that it's level, is I should be able to jump back with Betty, because Baronixes don't really jump like up very high, they just jump forward. Well, it feels like that, at least. Another one. Yeah. Oh no. I do jump up a little bit. Fuck it. Hopefully this isn't a bad idea. Oh yeah, this is... Okay, this is the ruins I see over there. Oh, I've just been done slowed. Oh no, I'm taking a massive beat in here. What's doing so much damage to me? Oh my god, let it heal up. Right, is this Scorpion Immortal? Oh, there you go. God damn, he's a tank here. Rockwell record 18, okay. What's that a picture of? Oh, it's his glasses in the mud by the look of it or something. 
I admit there are times when it is useful to live amongst simpletons. For example, I was able to trade several gallons of Lazarus chowder to a group of hunters in exchange for an entire contingent of tamed Gigantopithecus. And they never questioned whether it had been tested on humans yet. <laughs> okay, he's got an army of apes. Well, I suppose if they return with another batch of apes, then I'll know the Lazarus chowder doesn't cause asphyxiation, won't I? It's not exactly a conclusive scientific trial, but I suppose it will serve. Unfortunately, all these primitive primates have given Rockwell Manor quite the pungent odour. Isabel said that she is working on some sort of air freshener, but I hope she makes haste. Okay. He's traded some uh, chowder for some apes. Okay, good, good job. Definitely got a bargain there. Pretty cool. I'm guessing that doesn't end well for him, right? Because one of the bosses is the uh, Gigantopithecus. Right. Leave that there to rest up because uh, that meat's not healing at all, really. Definitely think it's only fish that heals him. Oh no! Oh, damn it. And this goes back down. Okay, I thought it did. So it does go in a big circle. Right, I've got two grappling hooks, so... Can I just jump over to that? I don't reckon I can, but... Ooh! Ah, in fact, the massive. Pow. Um, can I jump that? Do I jump that? Fucking rip! Yeah! Oh, mate. Oh. I'm the jump king. Is that respawned already? Am I going the wrong way? Got an artifact. I was hoping I would have seen more. Um... Hey, let's see if it's only this way. This is a different direction. Let's see it's down there. So I can get back up this side, can't I? Healed up yet? Oh, almost half health. I ain't got much ammo, so I don't really want to go wandering around on my own now. Still not full out of barely half, but this will have to do. I've been in, got a drink, and watched a YouTube video. <laughs> Still not fucking full out. And uh, almost lost all my XP buff, but whatever. Must be some more loot in here somewhere. Come on. Where are we? Oh, it's done a loot background. Was that it? One loot box? There's more in other caves, aren't there? We're going to have to come back down there and have another check and um, see if it'll just spawn another one anywhere. But, um, I haven't seen anything. Maybe I've missed something. Like I said, there's no map on the wiki to see where I'm going. I'm just sort of guessing. Um, and I've worked out it is one big circle, it does join up no matter which way you go. Uh, definitely feels like it's safer to go to the right with something like a baryonyx um, because everything that way seems to be jumpable one way and the other. If you uh, go around to the left, there seems to be places where you can jump down but I don't think you'll jump back out. You might be able to but I didn't want to risk it with Betty. There's Big Berry peering over the top of the wall, look. <laughs> All right. Right, let's get Betty back in here. Pow. Boom, Betty's done. Now she can sit her and head up. 
Let me just see something. Oh, there we go. Yeah, fish definitely heals them. Okay. So she'll eat meat, like, to keep her hunger down or whatever. Um, but, yeah, it's the fish that heals her. Alright, cool. Right. <laughs> okay. Uh, hopefully I won't need to move this. Boom. <laughs> One big table. And all four. Yep, you guessed it. Boom. <laughs> I can't help myself. It's got to be done. That actually looks pretty cool. I like it.